All right, hi everybody. This is Pearson uh, with Journals of Wannabe. This uh, I'm back at the Eden Garden, as I call it. Um, I need to put these in the garden. I wanted to show you uh, what I'm just pulling out right now. Uh, so I'm throwing, I'm pulling out anything that's about to go to seed, which this prickly lettuce uh, weed is going to seed, and there was uh, a mat ground cover of uh, of uh, henbit kind of all throughout here so I'm pulling that stuff out because I I don't want to leave the the weeds to go to seed I only want stuff seeding that I want coming back next year uh, this is uh, carrot seed or carrot flower that's gonna go to seed and then I've got some cilantro and some onion that's going to seed I'll let that stuff stay uh, for those that this is their first time this Eden Garden is called my Eden Theory, uh, where I just let things go to seed year after year, my edibles, and uh, harvest what comes up naturally. And so, uh, obviously, you can see I've just got mats of lettuce. Lettuce is basically a weed. <laughs> uh, lettuce is so easy to grow. Same with uh, carrots. They're just coming up everywhere. And so I just pulled this guy out. Uh, this is the first carrot I'm going to eat from this garden this year. Uh, we had a ton of cilantro that we harvested, obviously a ton of uh, lettuce that we've already eaten, um, and uh, asparagus over on, the, on this side. But uh, the goal of today was to kind of clear out the stuff, the weeds that are going to go seed, uh, so that I don't have weed seeds that end up in here next year, and uh, replace the empty spots that I have with tomatoes that I started. And I've got some uh, peppers in here as well and some chamomile. And so I'm just gonna let, you know, I'll, uh, I'll pull out those uh, weeds, which I call my placeholders. I know uh, it would just drive people nuts to leave big old weeds in here, but they really are just a placeholder for me. It's kind of the yin yang, uh, the weeds are the yin to my yang of gardening. Uh, they just hold the spots. And when I need my warm season stuff to go in, I pull my weeds out and throw in the warm season stuff in the places where I leave empty spaces. You can see I've got uh, tomato in here already. I've also got some other warm season stuff that I've planted around here already as well. These are just extras. And I thought, well, I'll just throw them in here anyways right now. So, um, yeah, the theory is to uh, create... Uh, an environment that naturally promotes edibles to come up year after year without much effort at all on your part. Uh, obviously, kind of like um, Adam and Eve were to tend to the garden and take care of it, this is me tending and taking care of the garden that's already growing. Um, I don't have to have beautiful uh, rows. You know, if that's you and you've got that kind of OCD, I understand and I've got another garden that I've, I'm growing this year that you can see on my channel. Of That's a very uh, traditional, no-till, beautiful rose garden. And this is my experiment garden. So, you know, I'm, uh, I'm pulling, uh, pulling the weeds out right now. Pulled up this carrot by accident. Uh, I'll try it out. I'm sure it tastes fantastic. But I uh, wanted to give an update on what I'm doing. I'll throw these in. If you uh, want to see more updates of this type of content, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I'd love to have you on the journey. Uh, that is all for right now. I'm going to get working and pull the rest of these uh, prickly lettuce out of the garden. Okay, bye.